Hi, I'm McLean, and welcome back to putting silly limitations on myself for no good reason. Um, still playing Final Fantasy IV Advance, uh, Fat of the Land. And this is where it gets interesting, because <laughs> I'm at the part of the game now where it really expects you to have a fat wallet and go in and buy everything you need. Oh, it didn't work. Did I not equip his sword? I don't think I equipped his sword. Let's get out of here. Because I was going to show you something cool. I don't think I ever equipped... Deathbringer. There we go. Okay. I was going to say, Cecil has an insta-death sword now, and it always works on this giant bird thing, which is kind of cool. So, this... Move. This is why I'm so sad. Oh, wait. Oh yeah, that's right, they just changed the name. I'm looking at this going, what is this? So, they uh, they give you all this awesome armor here that it looks like no one can wear, but it's actually the Paladin equipment set for after Cecil levels up here, and it's all really, really good stuff. And I'm not going to be able to buy any of it. I'm also not going to be able to buy any of this Gaia gear for uh, Paladin Porum. And I can't remember what the hell they come equipped with. So, let's just go... I don't think there's anything hidden in this town. I think there's nothing but sadness for me in this town. They're all pissed at me because I stole their crystal and killed a bunch of people earlier. Uh, da, da, da. Cecil's like, no, I'm totally good now. And he's like, yeah, let's send you to your death and here's a couple of five-year-olds to go with you. Da, 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 da. Okay, so, what do these kids come with? Oh my god, they're so weak. Um, let's see, Porum is my healer, so let's give her my best, ooh, that's already the best equipment for her, huh? Oh, mercy, this is going to be rough. And then Palum, I think, can get an Ice Rod upgrade, which is not going to be super exciting. Um, I don't think there's anything else to find in this town. There might be some treasure somewhere. I'll just do a quick spin. I don't want to talk to her. She turns you into a frog, I think. Wow, that's different. Baron shall burn in the fieriest pits. That was not nearly as dramatic in the original version. And I think the inn charges you something ridiculous if you come here before talking to the elder and getting Palamon Porum. I think they try to charge you like 10,000 gold or something. It's still pretty expensive. 200 gold, I feel like, is a gill or whatever they call it. I feel like it's still a lot. Um, maybe there isn't anything to pick up in this town, which is a real shame, because I sure could use some, uh, equipment here. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Let's see what I'm missing out on here. Flame rod, healing staff, holy arrows, all good stuff. So, I'm not going to grind a lot, but since I can insta-kill those flying bird things, I want to kill a couple of them before I go too far, because I think I need to get some more magic for these kids. I forget when she learns Cura, but I think it's pretty soon. Uh, you can still use... Go back. Dark. I'm not going to grind for very long, but I'd like to gain them a level or two, because these guys are super fun to kill. KO! Hmm. I think I just made him defend. Oh, crap. 
Perhaps my fast forwarding shenanigans are gonna make me pay. Alright. Screw it. Let's just go for it. Because this is just gonna get me killed. Okay. I really wish I had some armor for them, but oh well. Hey there, Ronerj. I don't know how to say your name. Alright, so if I have him attack him. Get what the birds dislike, but I think fire will work. I forget what cry does. I think it like lowers their accuracy or something. Ooh, fire does not work very good. Oh, poor him. You're so squishy. Flustered the enemy. Okay, Roner. That is much easier to say. And I hope I can even get to Mount Ordeals like this. Alright. Okay, Porum learned life. That's what I really needed. And Palum learned a level 2 fire magic spell. Alright. We're on our way. Yeah, so the real bummer about what's happening now is... When Cecil levels up, he goes from being a pretty strong knight character to being a freaking tank that'll jump out in front of everyone. Um, Torm, I just don't have anything for you to really do right now. You just tried to not die. He goes to becoming a tank, but unfortunately for us, he's not going to have the badass armor. Yeah, that's why I kind of bail. I kind of gave up on grinding because I was like, "Wait, there's a white chocobo coming up." So he's going to be. Uh, he has that auto cover ability, which I love normally. But he's going to be jumping out in front of people, um, wearing Kane's old iron armor. I wonder, I can't remember when she learns Cura. So we may be bailing back here a few times. And let's see. And sort my magic real quick. Okay, I'll set. Really? Oh, I can one-shot you. Thank you. I don't know if he comes with the Gaia robe now or not. I don't like the look of this. He comes, I thought he just came with like cloth armor, but maybe that's not true. Oh, I forgot there's a meanwhile scene. Oh no, Rosa. They changed the, uh, the original game had that blade hanging over Rosa. And then they changed that for the American release into a big old steel ball. Because I guess a blade is worse than getting crushed by a big old steel ball. I don't know, but they changed it back to a blade for this version. Alright, I guess I need to try my hand against this party and see how bad it is. I really wish she had a heal staff right now. Um, oh, this order kind of sucks. Oh well.
Yeah, they changed the name of a lot of the equipment because uh, I was staring at the Paladin set, which is called like Knight's Armor and stuff like that. Uh, you have to be. Come on. Oh, I wish you had a flame rod. <laughs> All right, Palmyra, Fira, however you even want to say that. Please be something good. Ooh, a potion. And another potion. Oh, yeah. I forgot. They really don't make you wait that long for Tella. I did steal Rydia's Ice Rod, which is something. I think it's mostly more of a magic bump than anything else. Talkie, 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 talkie. I love you, Palamon Porum, but I'm just not interested in what you gotta say. All right, so what does old Tella come with? He, well, he does come with a Gia gear, um, which I'm going to steal and put that on my main healer. And then it's best equipment him. Give him a feather stat, a feather cap, and you go in the back row. Tell a man, you're about to become useless. Um, sure, I'll fight you guys. I forget which of these ghost things absorb fire. I don't hope it's not this one, these ones. Crap, it's these ones. Tell him, man, you got a lot more HP than I remember. Die, fools. Cool. Yeah, that's the thing. Tella becomes a super glass cannon because he, like... <laughs> he Once he unlocks the rest of... I don't want to fight these guys again. Their blended weaknesses is annoying. You get, like, three shots of a level three spell, and then he's done. Man, I do not want to fight you guys. I missed a treasure somehow. I'll get it on the way down. I don't think it's anything cr critical right now. And then there's some hissing. I will actually drop a tent right here. All right, let's find out if I need to grind. I'm not sure how hard Scarmillion or whatever you say his name is going to be. Yeah, 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 yeah. Using my protect on everyone? 